mean, I care about keeping your jobs, but I care about keeping mine. Because if I lose my job, I have nothing. Do you hear me? I have nothing. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I need to take my last bathroom break as an employed man. Dude, we really messed up. What? <laughs> hey, you! There were two guys with a truck that were just here. Do you know where they went? Oh, yeah. They're taking the shortcut out to Highway 13 to the court dealership. What? Most dangerous highway in the country. How much do you want for that bike? <laughs> You idiots! This is the most dangerous highway in the country! But it's the only way to make it to the dealership in time. Get out of the driver's seat. I am turning this thing around. Guys, I don't think we can turn around. Ah! Step on it! Step on it! Benson, watch out! this, Benson. Rigby, you ready for some extreme carton? Extreme carton! Hold on. <laughs> Take the wheel. <laughs> Hang on, Benson! still open? Let me guess. Last day on the warranty. Well, Benson, at least we got the cart to the dealership. Yeah, but the truck is totaled. I'm not sure that's a good idea. It is a terrific idea. Just read it, bros. It's starting to smell like B.O. in here for some reason. The hungry, hungry, soul-sucking death worm. The soul-sucking death worm was so, so hungry. Pull the tab! He searched far and wide for souls to eat, but only got hungrier. This is the most boring part of the book. It gets much better. And once all the souls were eaten, he took a nice long nap. The end. That was a pretty good book. No, wait. You forgot to pull the last tab. Uh... Pull it! This is my favorite part! What's the point? The book's over, dude. If you don't, I won't go to bed. <laughs> don't be afraid, just feed it! What do we feed it? Souls. Monokai! <laughs> <laughs> catch! <laughs> Give it the f- 
We read you the story. Now go to sleep! I could have been killed! I'm never going to sleep! Never, ever! Look at the time! <gasps> Mommy and Daddy will be back any minute now, and when they see me wide awake, they'll go ballistic. <gasps> huh? Dude, we're so dead. He could be all right. We're back! Oh, what happened there? Broken furniture all over the place. Fires everywhere. My favorite art, ruined. Unbelievable. And what about Thomas? Uh, Thomas? Oh. He's out cold. Oh, thanks for a perfect anniversary, darling. Right, you two are the best babysitters we've ever had. You certainly did better than the last few. <laughs> I'm impressed. I was sure you'd perish. Yeah, thanks. But you know what we want. Bring Muscle Man back. All right, fine. A deal's a deal. <laughs> you know, it's not easy juggling a full-time job and raising a family, so don't expect it to be so easy to get one of your souls back next time, which will be soon. What with Muscle Man entering that hot dog eating contest? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, you're going to die in a hot dog eating contest. Ta. Wait, how do we get home? Forget those two lessons. Only one that matters is you never quit. What's the matter, Rick, baby? Giving up already? I knew you were a quitter the moment I laid eyes on you. Just say it, Rick, baby! You wanna quit? Just say it! No! Muscle Man! None of this has to do with mentoring! You're not a mentor! You're just a big, fat, smelly jerk! Well, then I guess we're done here. If you can't appreciate what I'm trying to do for you, then you don't deserve this job, quitter! No, don't! I'll get fired! What are you doing? Get off my face! It's over! No way! I've gone through too much! Get off of me, quitter! No! I'll never quit! I am not a quitter! Here we go, baby. If he lets go of Muscle Man, I get to fire him. Oh, my! <laughs> Vincent, you've got to stop this. He's going to kill him. Hmm. He's still got a minute to go. Still got ten seconds. Oh, 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 oh. 
Mentorship program. <sighs> Woo! Yo, Benson, this one's good to go. Dude, good job. Thanks. Rigby, I'm proud of you. Not only did you last the whole day without quitting, but you applied what you learned from your mentor to keep your job. Welcome back. Nice. Woo! <laughs> Congratulations, Rigby. I knew you could do it. Thanks, Pops. Not everybody agrees with my mentorship style. It's even received its fair share of criticism throughout the years. But you took it like a man, bro. You showed heart out there today, Rig. B. Where are you gonna go now, muscle man? I don't know. Wherever the wind takes me, I guess. Probably find a place to settle down. And get a burger with large side of onion rings. See you around, ladies. Well, you want to go get some food or something? Sure, dude. But you should probably take a shower first. You smell like muscle man. There it is. The Trucker Hall of Fame. Whoa. Now let's go spread these hot ashes. <gasps> Where do you think you're going with that urn, son? Uh, what urn? Don't play dumb. We heard about your plan on the horn. You're a muscle dad, son. And what you got there is his hat's mortal remains. Let me in, you tools! Those ashes are worthless. Hey, you want to scatter them somewhere? Yeah, why don't you scatter them in that dumpster? <laughs> Dude, muscle man! What are you doing? You gotta turn back. You can't give up. Come on! You're gonna come all this way just to quit? What about muscle dad? Look, bros. My old man was a screw-up, and let's face it, so am I. I'm overweight, I work in a lame park, and you two and fives are my only friends. But the one thing that a Sorenstein almost never screws up is a prank. And my dad's hat ashes in that stuck-up trucker hall of fame is the funniest thing I can think of right now. Now are you ladies in or aren't you? <laughs> Dumpster. Yeah, I know. I just opened my mouth and it came out. Woo! Special delivery! Ah! Oh, truckers, we have a bogey going towards Memorial Hill. I repeat, a forklift driver's hat ashes are on Memorial Hill. Forklift driver? Ah! What's going on back there, bro? Dude, let's go! Oh, damn merit! Big Beast Cat! Got it! We gotta shake him! Hand over them ashes! Memorial Hills for truckers! We're not handing over anything! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Trucker Hall of Fame, kiss my dad's trucker hat ashes! Muscle Dad? <laughs> yeah, it's me, Muscle Son. Thanks for honoring your old man's last wish. No problem, Muscle Dad. <laughs> You desecrated this place. Now we're going to make roadkill out of you. Ah! Hey, Bear Dog, need a lift? Ah! <laughs> Did you see that? Dad, why didn't you tell me you were a forklift driver? I wanted you to be proud of me, muscle son. I'm sorry I lied to you all those years. 
It's okay, Muscle Dad. I forgive you. It's an honor to meet you, Muscle Dad. Looks like we got company. I'll hold him off. But how, Muscle Dad? That's what I'm talking about. Now go! Woo! You sure your dad can handle them on his own? He'll be fine. Come on, pull my finger! No! <laughs> Woo! I had a great time, dudes. This was the best road trip ever. We'll probably just be jerks to each other again tomorrow. But I really see you guys as good friends. Pranks and insults are just how my old man taught me to show it. Oh man, I sound like such a wiener. I'm glad you guys aren't awake to hear this. Or this. Huh? Dude, hustle, man.